Welcome to The Update, I'm Eleanor Quirk. Tensions in the Red Sea are escalating with reports Houthi rebels have targeted another commercial ship. It comes after Australia-backed missile strikes by the US and UK against the Iran-backed group in retaliation to attacks on merchant vessels. White House National Security Coordinator John Kirby says the US is prepared to take more action. Final warning to the Houthis, whether it's standing up a coalition of, uh, of ships in the Red Sea to defend against these attacks. I mean, honestly, the president has really been leading an international effort here to convince the Houthis that they need to stop these attacks. A woman's fighting for life after another music festival drug overdose. Paramedics called to Juicy Fest at the Melbourne showgrounds where the woman aged in her 30s was in a critical condition. It follows a mass overdose at last weekend's Hard Mission Festival, prompting fresh calls for pill testing. Credit card spending has hit a new record high after savvy shoppers made the most of the sale period. New figures from Rate City shows Australians spent $27 billion on credit card transactions in November. And a new survey shows Australian children, some younger than 14, are using dating apps like Tinder, Bumble and Hinge. Sport and entertainment are next. To sport and the Sixers took a 19-run victory over the Thunder in the Big Bash clash at the SCG in what may have been his final outing. Steve O'Keefe says it was a perfect send-off. I just think, you know, 40,000, if it's the last time I got to play, it's a fantastic night. I think a lot has to go to Dave Warner and Steve Smith and the tournament in a whole. It feels like every game's got a bit of context now. To entertainment and Dua Lipa's new man's been revealed, the pop sensation dating British actor Callum Turner. The pair were spotted dancing at an after party in LA for the premiere of his show Masters of the Air. And the first Usher trailer for Apple Music's Super Bowl halftime show has been released. The vid titled Usher 30 Years in the Making features a number of celebs celebrating the singer. And that's the latest from the Nova podcast team. We'll see you again soon for another episode of The Update.